And speaking of fake prophets, ladies and gentlemen, please meet Prophet Nana Poku of the Kingdom Prayer Ministry International in South Africa. Prophet Poku has an uncommon ministry of healing by kissing. <laughs> Stop! Stop it! Stop! Ah, it's enough! I said stop! Ah, ah. I have little kids watching this program. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Where are you run? Come! You are a sinner. Ah, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. This is just bad in every way. There's no way you can look at this that is not bad. Eh? How dare you kiss somebody without their consent? Eh? This is not your wife. And can you guys hear church members saying, Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, no. Oh my god, you I didn't ask you to play it. They had it the first time. It wasn't even like and my my you know that was not even pecking. That was a long kiss. Why? Eh? Oh by the way, if it's an elderly woman, he won't kiss them. He will only sit on them. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ah Father. And sometimes he lays his hands on the breast. <laughs> Father in heaven, one more time, no vex. Eh? <laughs> no vex. My Ghanaian people, you need to talk to your son. Is bleaching? I don't think so. <laughs> he's a man of God. Maybe it's just my eyes, but you know, his hands look darker than his face. Don't take offense, my chale brothers and sisters. We have them in Nigeria as well, and we shame them. You need to go and get your son from South Africa. He's embarrassing the name of Ghana in South Africa. And my people in South Africa, if you let him get away with this, and eh? after kissing, what is next? Uh, sex in the name of deliverance? Is that what you are waiting for? Me, I will continue to say my own. And yes, I'm also a Christian. So I'm not saying that you shouldn't believe in God. I'm just saying make you not shine your eye shine your eye Well, well, <laughs> there are so many scammers out there now. You guys know I don't know much. Guess what? I'm just keeping it real <laughs>